uh, who was elected in 78, and that term, they were two-year terms at the time, and I was the chair of uh, Parks and Rec, Recreation. So um, that was my responsibility for those two years. And then the second, the next two years when I was re-elected, I had planning, and that was a very challenging portfolio. And um, then, then the third one, which was a three-year term, so it was there seven years, it was, I was chairman of finance and administration. Well, with uh, Parks and Recreation, it uh, was mainly, you know, the uh, making sure we had facilities for the, the, all the various sports in town, and then, of course, the whole park, the arena, and then the parks, um, you know, care of the parks, that kind of thing. Planning was very challenging because it was in, uh, that would be in 80, 80, you know, it would probably be 80, 81, and uh, the Shaw was looking to expand on the common. So that was, uh, there was a great, um, a lot of public debate and a lot of public meetings that I had to chair and look after. Uh, we also were doing the estate lots, trying to protect the 26 or so estate lots in the town, not just the old town, but in, you know, St. St. David's and Queenston and so on, and protect them from uh, development, inappropriate development. And um, so that was pretty challenging too. Um, and Ed was always, uh, he always coached hockey here, and, um, and one year he was, you know, coach of the year. Um, and, um, and everything, everything that I ever got involved in, he was always involved in as well, always. You know, you got, I always have said that. He should have been the one in doing these things because he had so much expertise in, these, in the physical part of these buildings and so on that, um, you know, he had lots of expertise in that end. Our daughter tells all kinds of stories about, you know, when Ed was, would come home and I'd be gone or going out, flying out the door or wherever, whether to Brock or whether, because I did that all pretty well at night, on well, some courses in the daytime, but some at night, and, uh, and then the council meetings and all that sort of thing, and being away too, because I was often away, at um, council business and uh, so on. So no, it uh, he certainly did. <laughs> you could you couldn't do it without that kind of support. And I always had that kind, of, always presently even up have that kind of support from the whole family.